Oh, he sees me. He sees me. Have an arrow, dickbag. I know you're a pirate, but I'm a fucking Aztec, bitch. Aztec versus pirates. Oh, he dodged the arrow. Fucking come here. I'll shove your cutlass up your fucking ass. G'day, guys. My name's Josh. Yo, can't call me Zobwoodle, and welcome to a brand new game called New Dawn, which is an open world survival game, which, I mean, I love open world survival games, like Seven Days to Die, uh, Valheim, every other game I ever seem to play at all is just open world survival, they each take place in a different time period, and this one is, it's, it's getting me all sorts of excited, because this takes place at the golden age of piracy, so Assassin's Creed, Black Flag, all of the piratey goodness coming in, let alone an island, this is what it's about. You are a Jeffrey living on an island in the South Americas, and then some piratey dickbags come land on your island and you're like, OI! Get the fuck off your island, mate! And then you gotta go and kick them off your arm. And somehow, you gotta level up enough to do that. But straight away, it is in early access as you can see up the top. But I need to make- that's a big fucking bison! Oh! Oh, okay, that's a big bi uh, bison booty. All right, don't mind that. I need to create my character, first of all, and get myself feeling as native as possible. All right, there we go. There is me. I've got my sweet little man bun going, and I'm representing Stryer with my green and gold paint because, you know, that's I mean, I've got to, like, you know, be, be true to myself and make sure that I'm representing my country of origin, which is the mighty Stryer. So no one's going to invade my Australian island. All right, single player. There is a safe, there is a safe game. I've never opened this game for How's Your Side Game? New game! Thank you very much. Oh, that's pretty. Alligators and macaws and parrots and a giant goanna! Look at the size of that fucking lizard! Fuck that noise! Alright, here we go. So far, so good. Looks pretty good. Remove with sickle. Done. I will. Can I. Do I have a sickle? I probably need to make myself a sickle. This game's gorgeous, though. Look at my wonderful island. Okay, I can sprint. I can jump. All the animations look nice and fluid. It's green and lush as a freaking waterfall. Okay, I'm sold. I'm on board. I've been in this game. Oh, you gave me some booty when I turn. Yeah, look at that native booty. You! I do just want to go and turn down the... Su what? Wait one minute and 30 seconds before I can, can commit suicide. Okay. I <laughs> sure, whatever. Uh, controls? No. Please tell me I can change my mouse sensitivity. Okay, good. Uh, let's go like... 0.5, uh, apply settings, there we go, I don't need to be flipping around and going nuts, oh, I kind of killed the frame rate a little bit, come on, come back, come back to me, sort yourself out, think about it, we're all good, we're all, okay, there we go, there we go, just take some time to think about it, I want this giant rock, how do I, how do I has rock, can I has rock, can please, oh yes, I already have an axe, okay, give me the axe, I've got some meat, I've got a torch, keep that as well, Got a TP. A TP will protect you from the cold and rain. Very useful for traveling and exploring new locales. And a boater bag, a liquid receptacle used for carrying water. All right, just like to spin around. Can I? Can I harvest? Can I use my my thingo? And can I start harvesting with the axe? You got a freaking hatchet. Get some sticks. That's the whole point of the hatchet, isn't it? I like that I've immediately found some gold. It really is South America. I can't get a stick, but I can fucking start digging up some gold and some iron. Let's get, there we go. Get all the resources I need. Uh, combat. Proceed. Active. Disable. Target enemy with the with the, the mouse right. Directional attack. Mouse middle. Dodge. Uh, it's space. Uh, dodge direction plus target enemy attack is okay. That was that's not as confusing so much at all. Uh, but I am gonna go fill up my boater bag. Can I? Okay, okay, that's that's not as good. What, what's this? Is this a rock? That's some clay. Can I have the clay? I can. See, the hatchet can do everything except apparently get myself some twigs. Can I cut down this with it? No, I need my I need my sickle to get some bamboo. I can get lava as well. I mean, is, is it still lava if it's like it's been solidified into a rock? Well, there's a big deary that's killing the oh the deary ran into the water. Get water. E. Water is full. Well, is my oh my frame rate's dying a little bit. Is my boater bag full? It is full. Okay, I'm just gonna ah 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 frames. Please run away, run away from the water. There we go. Oh, that was a bad time. Okay, apparently I can't go near the water. Oh, I heard a growl. Oh, I see a growl. Oh, oh, the frames, please. Frames, please. It's not the time. Not the time, frames. Ah, oh, it's running at less than 10 FPS, and I can't fucking see this fucking wolf I'm trying to attack. Okay, you just stay over there. You can just stay over there until my game decides it wants to work again. Ah, oh, no! I keep trying to turn down the settings more and more to try and give it any sort of a chance at actually, like, just being reasonably normal. And even at like real low settings, it's still running at like 14 uh, FPS. Sometimes it just jumps up to 60 and it's all nice and lovely. But then you have times like this 
where I'm trying to stab a wolf. 80%. There we go. Oh, 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 see, the frames go good, then the frames go bad. Just, oh, stab the fucking puppy. Come on, do something. You got to lose your mohawk to him. No. I died. I died. This officially makes no fucking sense. It's like, hey, use the right click to aim and then left click to attack. And I do that and he just fucking does nothing. And he gets mauled to death by one solitary wolfie Jeffrey. Oh, I don't, this game has so much potential. I want it to be good so bad. Look, and now I come back and I'm fucking, like, everything's fine. It's all smooth and wonderful. But when I try and find something, it goes to two frames a year. All right, fuck fighting wolves. I'm just going full, like, habitation mode. I'm going to build myself a house. I get some wood. Like I see, you use the hatchet on trees, just not the bamboo, apparently. I've spawned somewhere completely different. Although I can see there's like a, a, a cross on, on the compass up there, a kilometer away where I presumably died to the wolfie. Right, let's, just, let's get some wood and start like, figuring this shit out. A bow and arrow is what you always need in survival. Any open world survival game, your first step is a bow and arrow. So that is my next step in survival. Uh, what the hell is that? This is like a, a giant head like on the top of a mountain. What kind of civilization built that, but at the same time can't fight a wolf? Um, that's, I mean, that's daunting as shit, but okay. Uh, I don't know how to craft as such yet. Um... Let's see, settings, uh, controls. How does crap climb? You? Can I, can I climb up walls and shit? Uh, setting in game, reload weapon, spacebar, uh, inventory, interact. How do I, how do I craft? There is no, there is no crafting button. Okay, well let's try this. Let's try you. You? You. You does nothing. Maybe that's not going to climb ladders or some shit. I don't know. How do I make a bow and arrow? That's all I want. Here we go, crafting recipes. Okay, I need... A hundred bow and a hundred wood and twenty cloth to make a bow. That gee, holy crap! That's a lot of wood to make a bow. But okay, I mean I can do it. I, if I'm getting ten wood a crack, it means I have to cut down or well, hit a tree ten times. I just hit it for five, so I probably have a hundred wood. Now I just need cloth. How do I make cloth? I need. Well, that's a bandage. How do I make? How do I make the cloth? Cloth. Cloth. How do I make cloth? There, cloth uses ten cotton. Okay, let's find some cotton. You guys are gonna have to forgive me for being so bad at this. Oh, there's some cotton there. Yes, cotton. Uh, I've been so bad at this game to start off with. I mean, I've never played it before. I literally just jumped into it and then kind of got fucked by the frame rate a bit. So we're gonna learn how to do this together. Uh, cotton. Craft. Crafting one. How many, how many cottons do I need? It's a bold move, cotton. Let's see if it pays up. I need 20, 20 cloth, which takes... So, uh, wait. Do I get one cloth for five... I, how, how does that work? I don't know. Let's, let's, how many, how many can I make? Craft, craft, craft a bunch? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Craft, keep crafting. There we go. I have a cloth. I'm going to have two cloths. Right. So I get two cloths per cotton and I need 20. Oh my God. I'm going to be here forever to make a bow. Easy, easy. Just slide. No, you're supposed to slide. Oh my god, why did you just, it was just like, it was just an incline, it was fine. Why did you fall to your death? Oh man, I just lost my progress. It took me ages to get anywhere with that, now I have to start all over again. Oh, ball sacks. So okay, so both my deaths stay on the compass, that's good. There's like a full way back to get all the stuff I just dropped. There's a moose over there. Right, now I know the first thing I need to do, well, actually the first thing I need to do, there's a big head over there, is equip my hatchet, and then go find some freaking cotton. Actually, more importantly, where the hell have I just spawned? What is this? There's a giant structure that I've just spawned inside of. And I'm very good. There's giant heads over there. This is like a hangar, but like with a pillar in the middle. Can I climb the pillar? Is that what the climb function does? Can I get to the top of this thing? I really want to. Please, pretty please. It was you, wasn't it? You. You? Okay, put your... Can I... No, it doesn't do anything. Okay. Back to the cotton finding. Oh, is that cotton over there? That's a big white rock. Where? Oh, there's a deer. Kill the deer. Kill. Eh. Kill. Kill. Stab. Do something. Do anything. Combat mode. There you go. Yes. Keep stabbing. Keep stabbing. Take its meat. Take its meat and its antlers to hang on my imaginary wall. Keep stabbing. I can't see what I'm doing anymore. Just keep going. 20%. One more to do it. No, I missed it. There. 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 Any of them. Yes, good. Okay, I got knocked around, but I killed him. Caribou skin, pressed interact. Uh, oh, it's all here. Okay, take, 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 take. I got I got 10 cloth out of killing a deer. Not sure how that works. Didn't think the deer was wearing any clothes, but I'll take it either way. Um, right. Where, so I guess now my main, my main option is just to murder every deer I find instead of finding cotton. Is that what you're telling me? I don't know. <gasps> There's a bison. Murder the bison. Oh, it's a bear. 
Oh, that's a bear. Okay. Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. Yeah, friggin' nah, mate. No, 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 no. No way. If I had a trolley, I'd throw it at you. I am leaving. Oh, okay. I got so distracted by trying to murder a bison. He, he was a smart bison. He led me off. Oh. Did I, is this the one I killed? No, I killed that one somewhere else. Are you alive? Can I just stab? If you actually aim at it, maybe. No, it's alive. It's just having a nap. Okay, don't mind me. You just continue your nap. I'll just quickly stab you with a hatchet until you die. Yes. There, wait, you dead? Yes. Okay, good. Now, give me all your goodness. There we go. 20. And everything else is good for me. Now, I just need some wood. I can make a freaking bow. Yes, progress. Yes, I have enough to build my bow. Craft that shit. How, uh, arrow, arrow drug? Arrow, hunting arrow. I need stone and wood. I have neither of them. Right, let's go find some more trees. Uh, it's really kind of annoying that I can't cut down, like, the little, like, the, the, the like, little sapling trees. Like, the little ones that seem like more of a hatchet kind of job. I can only cut down the big monstrosities. And even then, I only get 50 wood per giant tree out of these things. I got more wood out of the tiny ones, like, when I, before I died last time. So that's some, I've got 50 wood. Now I just need to find some stone, which could be anywhere. Are you stone? No, I can't. I can't have the stones on the ground. That looks like a stone. Can I cut down this tree? Yeah, see? I mean, look. I get the same amount of wood out of this little pissy little tree as I did the big behemoth I just cut down. But more importantly, stony goodness. Give me that. No, that's not a stone I can break. Or what? How do I know the difference between, like, a breakable stone? That's lava. I'm not going to get anything out of that. I mean, lava's good and all, but I can't use it to make arrows with for some reason. Where, where, what are the, what are the, what's the breakable stone and what's the not breakable stone? Ah, oh, okay. So the stone that I can gather is the big white bastards. I think it looks like a beluga whale coming out of the ground. Right, I have some stone, which means I should be able to make some arrows. Craft eight. I can only make eight arrows. Okay, I need to find some more stone. Oh, there's some white ones over there. Okay. All right, now I understand what I'm actually looking for. It makes a whole lot more sense to me. But I also am going to get my bow, my brand new made bow. Uh, re my, the ground just changed. I brought that out. How do I... How 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 does shoot? How I need to I need to figure out how to shoot this thing before I come up against a wolf again. Because otherwise the wolf will eat me and I have to do this all over again. I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. I've got my bow goes for hunting. got my arrows. A, a hunting bow arrow in... How do I reload? E, anything? Uh, aiming right, uh, mouse right, fire mouse left, up first person. Okay, so I can go first person, all right. But I still can't shoot anything. How do I get my bow to work? Oh, I think I did it. I pressed four. Like I, yes, there we go. So I equipped, I had the, the, the arrows in my hotkey and I pressed the button that they were, the slot they were in. And that then made my bow able to use the arrows. That was confusing and annoying, but I got it done in the end. Alright, well, now that I have a bow, I feel a whole lot better about my situation in general. Let's get some more wood and some more stone, make some more arrows, because 10 is not enough. So then I feel like I can pick off some things from a distance. Oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. I've made it to the coast, and I see no sails, so those filthy Europeans must not have brought their diseased-ridden douchebaggy faces here yet and pillaged my island, so I guess I'm safe for the moment. But I should probably start thinking about where I'm going to build, like, a base or something. The sun's probably going down... That's salt water, so that's not a good water supply. Let's head back inland and see if we can find that stream I started next to the first time, which was a golden opportunity that I immediately died with. If we can find that stream, then I have a water source, and there's deer and stuff, I've got food sources, and we can start thinking about a bit more of a long-term solution to my, well, just staying alive. Oh, I take it back. I went around and I found a cove. Look at that, that looks like invaders. Oh, okay. Well then. That is gonna be a problem. Have they have they found a stream? I don't I don't know. So I feel weird that they've like, they've like shacked up there and not over like that's over that way is the beach I was on just a second ago. So I need to find somewhere else to live. I need to find somewhere where they're not gonna find me, but more importantly, I can find them if I need to. Ah yes, here we go. Some fresh water. That's what I needed. Uh, I don't see any Jeffreys around or wolves or bears or anything like that. Just quickly go down to the water's edge, fill up my my bow bag, whatever it was called. So I have some water to take with me. Then we can start thinking about where to build a base. Oh, look, there's a giant head here. Is this the giant head I saw from a distance? Well, there's the, that must be. There's the big structure I was in to start with. Uh, wait, can I... Well, first of all, can I drink the water now that I have it? I feel like now if I have a, a bag full of water on my back, I'm a little bit thirsty. I should probably drink some of that shit. 
No, it didn't, didn't do a lot. There we go. Now I'm full. Refill that. Refill my water. All right. Let's go find someone to build a base. And we can start plotting how to kick these pirates off the island. Everyone stop. Everyone stop. I see Jeffries. There's Jeffries here on my island at my water source. It's time to fuck him up. Oh, he sees me. He sees me. Have an arrow, dick bag. I know you're a pirate, but I'm a fucking Aztec, bitch. Aztec versus pirates. Oh, he dodged the arrow. Fucking come here. I'll shove your cutlass up your fucking ass. Oh my god, that was brutal. I shot an arrow straight through that pirate's face. Where's the next one? Aztec v pirates, I'm excited. Come at me. This guy's got a freaking musket. That's not allowed. You can't bring up a gun to a bow and arrow and sword fight. There we go, he's dead. Are you a woman? You look like one. Oh yes, cop that right in the heart. And another one, and another one. Arrows for days. Oh, I've got, I've got no more arrows. Wait, do I have arrows? I do have arrows. Okay, quickly put them in there. There we go. Quick, uh, re-equip them. Oh, Jesus Christ, where'd you come from? You come out of nowhere. No, go away, dickbag. I'll put an arrow through your nose like I did to your mate. Just keep shooting. The arrows don't quite go where you point them. There we go. Okay, we're good. Is there any more? There's bodies everywhere. One Aztec can kill thousands of pirates like this idiot. Boom, sit down. I never realized how much I wanted a game where I can play as Aztecs v pirates until right now when I can shoot these Muppets in the face. Go back to the Caribbean. Go back to uh, freaking Nassau with your rum and your pirates and your booty because you ain't getting any here. Three arrows in the throat and he's fucking down. There's one pirate left all the way over there, but I kind of want to see if I can... Can I can I loot these guys and take take their stuff? Because I'd really appreciate it if I could. Because at the moment I I put so many arrows and so many Jeffs that I now have none left. Oh, it's a treasure chest. Open chest. Oh, there's fucking a pistol and a sword. <gasps> yes. Oh my god, I'm excited. Uh, well, all the guys, the guys all swallowed my arrows and disappeared. So I guess my only option now is to quickly go boom, take my pistol, and I assume I have to do the same thing with that. And say like three and then eight. No, reload. Oh, they all spawned again. No, I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. I was I was using your own guns against. Come on, get out of the way, dude. I don't want to kill you right now, but I will. I'm trying to use fucking modern weapons and I'm a Native American. I have no idea what I'm doing. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ, run. I don't know how to use this, but I'm going to try anyway. Just go like, no, no, it didn't work. It didn't work. I, I take it back. I take it back. He's reloading his musket. Oh, quick, quick. There we go. Good shot. Oh, I'm out of bullets. I'm out of bullets. I'm gonna fuck him up. Go, no, dude. You get it. You got. Use your sword. No, I found a sweet sword. I didn't even get to use it. Come on. Right. Well, it turns out there is a lot for me to learn about how to play this game properly and not be such a nub. I mean, those pirates kept spawning like to infinity, I guess, because I I cleared that camp, found a cool pistol. For some reason, couldn't load the pistol with the shot I had. Maybe I need to find powder or something to go with it. I don't. I don't know. But I, oh, that's, this is pretty, but like, this game's so pretty, the idea is so cool, and I'm so excited for it to get better and better, so I'm gonna have to spend some time learning how to play, so when I come back and play another, uh, uh, well, another game in another episode, I'll actually know what I'm doing, and can, like, you know, hold up the Aztec banner against these pirate invaders with some pride, but I'll have to do that in another episode, because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to all the patrons on Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make sure to like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. But don't talk to you there first. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.